Hey guys, just want to make a quick video to let you know how I save these beautiful curls for another day. So I'm going to show you guys real quick what I do. Hold on. Okay. What I do to save these beautiful curls for another day. Let me let you zoom in one more time. You see the moisture is back. You see the shine is back. You see all. You see all that goodness. Look, you see all that goodness. It's just all goodness right there. Look at that. I got inches, y'all. So, this is all I do. If you have long hair, then I see that they do a pineapple. They bring all their hair to the front. You know as well as I know that that is not my case right now. I am far from the big pineapple. However, I do have a field of pineapple trees. <laughs> so what I do for my little warm aloe vera juice and water, I spray it just enough. It's already soft, but just enough to, you know, do what I'm about to do without disturbing it too much. I'm going to go ahead and take out my little pins, my little bobby pins. And all I'm pretty much going to do is use these little scrunchies here. And just for a little added protection. If I can find uh, it, I cannot. So, I'm going to go with this one. That's just a little shea butter. Shea butter oil. That's all. I take it. Put it in my hand. Stand it up. Rub my hand. And I just rub my hair. Just to break if there's any cast from the gel, which there's not, but I add it anyway, just so I can have that moisture, because I am big on moisture these days, big, and I simply say, Charlotte, and Charlotte said, hmm, I say, what we going to do to make sure that we don't have to do anything to our hair tomorrow, just in case you decide you don't want to do anything to your hair, and I say, well, pineapple trees. I'm going to put up my pineapple trees. So this is how I put up my pineapple trees, guys. Based on how my hair is already falling, I just grab, grab me some hair, put it together, try not to disturb the curls, and I grab it, and I have to do two times, because remember, I have short hair. And I'll come over here, and I'll separate on this side, try not to put too much together in one spot, because like I said, I don't want to disturb the curl patterns, and I don't want to disturb the moisture. And I come over here, and I do the exact same thing, just feeling, feeling my way down apart. Go ahead and put this piece in there with that. Y'all see those? Y'all see those curls? Can you see them? Yeah. They're there. And look. Oh, it's so LCO method. LCO method. Shea moisture. Aloe vera juice. And I get those curls. From that moisturized hair. <laughs> Y'all, I did I, I you learn as you go and you hear L O C method. That's the first thing you hear. So that's the first thing I went with, because I'm new on the journey. So I was like, L O C method it is. L O C method is not for everybody. And for the person that came out with the LCO method, 
me and my hair would just like to personally thank you. I don't know who you are, but I would like to thank you. I really would because you saved my hair before I went any further and made a calamity. That's a word made a, let's not say calamity because I don't know if that really fits there. Let's say catastrophe. Yeah. Before I made a catastrophe. Oh, I just love I just love the fact that the aloe vera juice can have so many benefits on it. So it's like you don't, I don't have to worry about it I'm spraying too much. It's just moisture. And I'm going to need one more. But you see how I got it separated? And I'm going to do one more for right here. And I just grab, I'm trying to grab it like from the root, so I won't disturb the curls. Just trying to stretch it out a little bit. And I put me another little thingy on. That's it. I put my little pineapple trees in. And we all know that the ends of our hair is the oldest part of our hair. So we want to make sure we take care of the oldest part of our hair. So I spray my ends. Make sure they get all the little extra juiciness that they need. If you want to apply some oil to that, you could do that as well. But, uh, I don't know what that is. Okay, disappear. That's it, and I make sure I don't have it too tight because I don't want to pull my ends. I don't have a problem with my edges. I don't bother my edges, and my edges don't bother me. We have a relationship. So, I don't want to disturb them and they don't disturb me. So, I put my little set cap on. Okay. And that's it, guys. And I go to sleep. And when I get up, I take my bands off. I missed it again. Mm -hmm. Play with it like that. Mm -hmm. A little shake. If I have to add a little extra gel, I'll add a little extra gel. But stay tuned for the next video because I guarantee you the next video I'm going to be using either one or two products. And I think I'm going to be using the mask because it's time for my hair to get a deep conditioning. It's time to strengthen and restore. Yes. Deep conditioning. Or the intensive hydration twist defining custard. Because you all know I like braid outs and twist outs, but they've been, they look cute, but they just haven't been shining the way I want them to shine. So I think by using this, it may give me a little more. A lot more definition so that's it uh, if you're new here go ahead and subscribe click the notification bell jump on board because this journey is taking off this journey is taking off we can only go forward from here no more going backwards We're going forward only how to save your curls to live to fight another day like the daddy said on Friday, to live, to fight another day. <laughs> everything you do, keep God first in everything you do. All right. Y'all have a blessed one.